Welcome back guys. So today we have the, actually we're gonna be replacing everything here. We're gonna be replacing the membrane. And then in here we have the three uh, cartridges here that we're gonna be changing. So yeah, I'm gonna open these up, get everything out. And then I'll show you guys how to replace all the cartridges and even the membrane in here. <laughs> Thank you. 
this stuff because it's hard and uh, I went through all my tools and I couldn't find like any pliers or anything. What I did is that I put a string through it and then I used that to pull. And yeah, that's how you take out the membrane. But I'm gonna put you guys back up there and then I'll put in the new one that I have here. And then yeah, we should be done. <laughs> Alright guys, so I just finished installing everything. I put everything brand new. As you can see, this one's clean. Let me show you guys the old one right here. It's all brown and nasty. And then I replaced this one right here. And this one right here, look how white it is. It's brand new. I know, I know the label is backwards on both of these, but it is what it is. But yeah, you see, I replaced all of them, even the membrane right here. And the main issue with that was that you usually need pliers to like take them out, like, you know, to pull them out. And I didn't have any, but I just remembered that I had some in my tackle box, which I forgot. But what I just did is that I did it my own way and I just put a string through here, through this little hole. And then when I got the string over, I used it as a lever to pull out. So yeah, I just pulled it out. But yeah, just make sure you guys have the right tools and everything. But before you know you guys are done with this, make sure you guys rinse it out for like 30 minutes, at least the membrane. You know, you gotta make sure you rinse it all out for at least 30 minutes to make sure there's no chemicals or anything or any residue from packaging and stuff like that. But yeah, guys, I know the video was kind of film weird. I was here by myself. I didn't really have anyone to film for me. So yeah, sorry about that, but yeah, I just replaced it and you guys can do it too. I'm gonna try to leave links down below of all the things I, I bought to replace them. And yeah, right now I'm gonna rinse everything out and you know, that's pretty much all you have to do to change them. You just, you know, take off the tabs, you pull on them like this and then they come right off. And then for these, which I was having troubles with, you're, you use this tool right here that they usually give you when you buy um you pull you push down on this and then you pull the tube and then the tube is supposed to come out and then once it comes out you replace it you can unscrew these if you want to or and reuse them that's what i had to do and then once you're done you put the you put the hose back in you grab this you pull on the hose and then you put it in like this and then right there you see it's it's screwed on right there so that's pretty much what you do for all of it. Same thing here with these longer ones are easier. You just pull out, put in. Everything's pretty simple, but make sure when you take this one out, it will be hard. So you're probably gonna have to use a little tool like this to just loosen it. And then, yeah, it should be able to come out. And then remember when you put it back in, this has to be facing upwards. And like you saw in the video, I had trouble pushing it in. So I just took it out and then put it back in. And yeah, I went in and everything went fine. But if you guys have any, any, like, if you guys have any questions or anything like that, please let me know down below. And if you guys have any uh, ideas of videos I should make, let me know down below and till next time.